Me, I drink pine and ginger. And my man feel wine panetting and men play it at me. I drink pine and ginger. And my man feel wine panetting and men play it at me. So I have my roommates here. I'm Caitlin. Annika. And so we're just going to answer some questions that we gathered up from YouTube videos and Instagram and stuff like that. Do we know each other beforehand? Nah. <laughs> sort of. <laughs> yeah. I, I, I met Annika through the the room sync up. Mm -hmm. We found like our little roommates. Mm -hmm. And then they, they knew each other from orientation. orientation. Yeah, and then I met her after meeting her. Um, kind of like we all met up. Cleanest to messiest. Messiest. In order. Oh well, in order. Uh, middle. <laughs> Cleanest. Messiest. I'm not proud. That's just like, you know. <laughs> I don't know because I came in with OCD. She kind of took after me. Like she just started cleaning. And she got into the habit. She's working on it, but <laughs> she's not too super terrible. I can see messier people. That's true. Thank you. Mm -hmm. It means a lot. Of course. <laughs> what do we do when we're all together? Um, we hang in here. <laughs> yeah, pretty much. Pretty much. We just kind of just talk about Ew. anything that comes to mind. Mm -hmm. Sometimes watch movies. Mm -hmm. Attempt to watch movies. They're they're like sisters. Mm -hmm. So you know. Eh. What is our major? Um, music production. Oh, bio. Psychology. Uh, she may change to social work. One pro, one con. Yeah. yeah. Of having three roommates in one room. One pro would be just like having them having them to talk to, uh, just you know, getting along, socializing, just you know, kind of like um, what they like and what they dislike, just getting to just get <laughs> getting to know them better. Um, and a con would be, I guess, disagree. They're cool people to talk to. I don't really talk to females, but they're awesome. Like. They understand where I come from. We already had like a discussion, and they like kind of took into consideration how I am. And for so jam. <laughs> and one con, it sometimes it's like you want your own space. You know, you can't get that. But well, sometimes it depends on our schedule. But sometimes we just be chilling. Mine's a pro and a con. So being in the dorm, I'm gonna be with different personalities. So I like meeting new people. But at the same time, it's like, as you're meeting someone new, you don't want to say anything that can cause a reaction, a negative reaction. Yeah. So, I feel like I'm on my toes a lot. I feel like we're all are. So, yeah. Oh, pros and cons about each other. Okay, cool. Mm -hmm. We're about to be serious. No, be, like, be honest. I mean, yeah, people want the real, the real tea. <laughs> so, we gotta give it to them, you know? So, go ahead first. Okay. Um, I'm gonna... <laughs> I don't want to go in this order, though. Okay. Uh, oh, excuse yeah. me. Uh, yeah. Pro, okay, pros. And, I'll start with Gianna. Okay. G wavy. Mm -hmm. Pros and cons. Uh, pro is she's very helpful. She's very trustworthy. You can you can rely on her with anything. Um, she's very honest. Mm -hmm. Like she's very blunt about things. Um, I'm so sorry. <laughs> just, getting, just getting emotional. Um, cons. Maybe sometimes distant. Yeah, Maybe just that's so true. sometimes to herself. Like yeah. she's more introverted, which I don't mind that, but maybe yeah, sometimes she wants me to come out and just talk. So yeah, yeah, yeah. I'm but saying, yeah. that's pretty much it. And for Caitlin, she's very sweet, she's very caring, she's she's fun to talk to. Um she's just overall like a warm hearted person. Like you can't get on her bad oh my side. God. And yeah. the con I would be would be is she could be sometimes moody. So you can't you, you never know no one to like and stop. Both Capricorn, so like so, yeah. Imagine what that's like. So sometimes you have to give her space, but overall she's just a sweetheart. So yeah. Alright, next <laughs> um. <laughs> Okay. Uh, it's fine. I could take it. <laughs> Yana. Mm -hmm. So pro. I don't have like older sisters, but I kind of consider her as like someone I can look up to, low key. <laughs> um, my God, what is? I'll take it. I'm good. No, really. Um, <laughs> as much as I don't want to admit it, I'm a sensitive person, so like. Some of the things that she says, like, I know we're, we'll be joking, but it's kind of like, okay. Yeah, and I'm trying to tell you to let me know. Yeah. Like, you should just be like, 
No, I'm fine, I'm fine. I'm like, Caitlin, yeah, just let me know. <laughs> I'm never gonna fix this problem. <laughs> um, you're really resourceful. Like, if I really need something, I yeah, she got go it. to Annika. Like, ramen noodles, I got Yeah, it. I can really <laughs> yeah. go to her for anything. Not even just ramen noodles. <laughs> like, it's really nice for her. Yes, come through. Yeah. Um, <laughs> cons. <laughs> my con. She has a lot of energy. <laughs> oh my god, yeah. yeah. She has okay. a lot of energy. I could be too hyper. No, it, it, it's not. You toned down more. I, I toned down? Yeah. Like, like, from last semester? or Definitely, yes. What? I get drained easily. Even if I'm not even like interacting with her, I mean we all we interact all the time. But like sometimes like she'll just get hype, and I'm just like <sighs> not in the mood. Yeah. <laughs> like I just like I don't know. It's like she takes my remaining energy. Yeah. Okay, yeah. yeah. hey, fair enough. But <laughs> that but that doesn't only happen with her. It happens with any like social situation I'm in. That's why I don't like to go out sometimes. But so that's mainly a con about me, <laughs> not even you. And pros about Annika. She's so funny. Like, she don't even have to do anything, and I'll be dying. Like, I can just look, I'll look at her from the corner of the room, and she's just dying. But she has good taste in music because she's a music major. Mm. Uh, she is resourceful. Like, she has a broom whenever I need my. Like, so, like, my side <laughs> a up. Broom, she has a broom, the vacuum, vacuum, yeah. all that. And it's like, she's really cool. Okay. Respect it. She's very honest. A con is that. At first, she was really quiet, and I was like, "Really? Like, speak I up? Was? Yeah, like you had energy I mean, and everything, but you just wouldn't speak up, like in yeah." A conversation. Just, I don't know how to start one. Sometimes it's like I don't, I don't know what to talk about. It's like I don't want you to get bored. She's herself, and that's like the most important. That's like one of the qualities I enjoy in a person. Like if they bring their soul. Pros about this one: <laughs> she is also very funny. She's like a little cousin, brother, sister. Um. I get to like pick on her, but it's like <laughs> gotta get lucky. With her. Okay, um, so they, like yeah, we like relate a lot. Con, Moody. yeah, I had to be like Caitlyn, like, are you good or are you not good? Like sometimes she doesn't talk. I guess that's okay. I guess all, all of us. us. Yeah, we get, we sometimes we just sometimes. get distant and we're not in the mood, but mm -hmm. like you know, it's we're still growing. She said, "Did you get along with your roommate when you first met?" I don't know. I'm, I'm gonna be honest. It was like, like, in when I, like Gianna and me weren't gonna room, mm -hmm. but Caitlin invited Gianna because we felt bad. And we did have our ups and downs like the first semester. I think this is more just getting used to each other. Um, miscommunications happen. Um, yeah, I don't. The first day though, I would just say we were just a little shy with each other, and like it was just you know trying to introduce ourselves and you know be ourselves around each other. So it's just getting used to. So we were like getting used to each other and everything and I was like I still didn't want to talk so I kind of keep to myself and then like, she's very introverted but, yeah. but like once you get to know her she'll she'll open up yeah like like that like you can't get on her bad side because oh yeah she'll, she'll I like you will I keep everything out. in and then <laughs> once it like hits a peak I see red and then Caitlyn's like in between like she's not introverted She's not introverted or out or like outgoing. Extrovert. She's 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 like in the middle. Like she'll talk to you, have like a casual combo, but like sometimes she'll just take a break and just you know. Mm -hmm. Okay. I can't. Yeah, I, I mean, it's, there's the nothing wrong with getting drained. It's just it's it's Which sometimes is so just, weird that you say that because you have so many friends. I feel like I can't I can't have friends like her. So first sure. semester, it took me a while. It took me like a month to make friends. I because they just, have more friends than I do. That's for sure in like physical form. Like, is the truth. <laughs> Physical friends, they they out they outnumber me. Like, I have a lot of social friends. Oh I listen to a lot of music. That's what makes me a humble person. I mean, that's what you have to follow. Like dancing. Like, like you have to like. A lot of people are weird here. <laughs> I mean, she has a point. We see some weird things around yeah. here. So, so you guys will get me. You guys will understand. How did you feel like before? Moving here? Yeah, yeah. How did you feel? Like the week before? I wanted to enjoy the experience. <laughs> like, oh my god. Yeah, exactly. Were you too? Yeah. At first, I was like, I want to get the college experience. I was like, oh my god, these girls actually want me in the I was like, I don't know. What if they don't like me? What if they reject me? Like, yeah. I don't know. You know, I had positive thoughts. I was like, we're going to make the best of it. This time, the third. I had a lot of anxiety mm -hmm. because I'm used to being by myself, not with other people. 
face every day. <laughs> so, That's annoying, yeah. Yeah, it's like, ugh. Especially how this room is set up. Like, I like looking at them. I should tell that story, in, right? What story? At <laughs> one point in time, like, I just wanted divider? to be away from people. Yeah. <laughs> I just wanted to be away from Guys. people. And she has a divider, <laughs> and I took the divider, and I like, I need my space because I cannot. I can't. I, every time I walk in, I feel like they're both staring at me, and I just don't want to deal with that. Nah, like, I get the same vibe. Like, sometimes I'm so lazy to whip out the divider. I'll just change. Like, right there. Yeah. But I don't really pay attention. It's what you look forward to the future like in the future i hope that we all like stay in contact with each other because i know like i want a single in the future and i don't want to lose contact with them because they're really dope and they were like my first friends here so oh my God. yeah for the future i want to still hang with them even if it's like summer break and i'm like you know because we we were here for like months like in last semester i still want to have contact with them even if they hate me after i'm still gonna like text them <laughs> I'm just looking forward to you know breaking barriers and just like knowing them more if you want to know how to spell my name is a n i k k a i get a lot of you know misspellings but yeah she'll okay. link it uh -huh. <laughs> down in the description box below mm -hmm. you guys already know mine it's you know down below um my instagram's on private <laughs> okay uh but it's caitlin underscore monet And that's it for the video. I hope you guys stay tuned for the next one and leave some suggestions down below. We'll see you on the other side. Bye. Peace. <laughs> oh, wavy, wavy. Bye. The one I got going crazy, crazy, crazy. The one I got the girls going crazy.